What's up guys, d in here. Today I want to show you guys how to do the big bonus challenge, or how I did it at least. There's only one, f like two days to do this, I guess. Um, so I wanted to show you guys how to do it really quickly. My game hasn't crashed too, too much recently, so I think I should be able to do this for you guys. My setup looks something like this, I believe. So this is my shared friend medal, pretty useful. Shout out to Tofu. Got my Kyrie here. Second chance. Got Kyrie beginning with uh, extra attack and a defense boost 3 max, which is really important. FFRK is Sefi. With, I switched his skill out. I switched it from attack boost 6 max Lux++ plus plus to an attack boost 9 max. Supernova plus Sephiroth. With basically perfect traits, just no extra attack. And AB8 max SP2 gauge. Angelic Amber here with pretty good traits. And AB9 max SP2 gauge. And then Ira with basically perfect traits as well. Hopefully the game doesn't crash while I play this. It's been crashing less and less recently for me, but I don't know. Um, so we'll see. Okay, so for this first turn, what we are gonna do is... Pop that. Hopefully I remember how to beat it, guys. We gotta hope for some combo procs as well, obviously. That's all good. So as you can see, um, he has max general and upright buffs right now, defense buffs right now, so what we're going to do is pop that, pop that, and then carry on. Need more of those combo procs, so please hit me up. So pretty solid, we're only on turn 2 right now. Or I mean, this is turn 3 I guess, but... So once we use Sephi there, we're gonna go ahead and proc his... Supernova, so we can get that 280% guilt boost. Yes, keep going with the combos. And then this turn we do have to finish him off basically because next turn um, is when his um, thing goes to revert, uh, power there, you see? So he reflects power now. Which is overall okay because we can just hopefully kill him with that. Oh. In case we didn't finish him off, but obviously just take some combo procs. Oop. And it'll work out. Um, this was five turns, but as you can see, you can do it with something similar to that in four turns if you are smart about it and if you get your combo procs in. So this one was a struggle for me, not because the actual quest was super hard but because of the difficulty to play this game because of how many crashes um i've been experiencing the past like week ish now by the um it's been a lot better though so hopefully it's better for you guys too. give it a shot give it a try let me know if you guys are still experiencing these things on android or if you're experiencing them on iphone now as well i am gonna be making more kingdom hearts union cross videos in the near future and maybe some you give videos as well so Hopefully you guys enjoy this content. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new to it. And I want to thank all my current subscribers for being subscribed to the channel. You guys are awesome. We... Are, I just dropped my phone, but I am hoping that we can somehow hit a thousand subs before... Not before the end of the year, per se, but before the end of February of 2020. That's, that's the goal, guys. 
So we're going to be out here grinding. Hopefully you guys have friends that aren't subscribed to the channel yet, but make sure you let them know about this channel so that I can help them out with some Kingdom Hearts Union cost content. And if they enjoy Yu-Gi-Oh, then that's a bonus because I don't do those videos very often. But if I do, there are hopefully some fire openings. Anyways, catch you all soon, guys. Um, yeah, you guys are awesome. Peace.